think hi. All right. We'll wait for 7 p.m., which is one minute. And let people join us and maybe make this a little bit closer. Welcome, guys. Feel like a... Can I adjust this a little more? All right. every day at 7 p.m. Um, hi, thank you guys for joining us. Um, my name is Nama, this is Nadav, um, and we joined you guys here today, hopefully in your living rooms, uh, for some jazz, springy jazz, quarantine jazz. Um, so we hope you guys sit back, relax, get a glass of wine or a whiskey or something, because it definitely makes us sound better the more you drink. Um, and enjoy. We're going to continue with, um, well, that was April in Paris. Obviously, we're not in Paris, although I was supposed to be in Paris, actually. Yeah. I don't know why I'm talking to the mic. There's no reason to do that because you guys are beyond the screen. It's potential audience. We can protect. Should I talk to the mic? Yeah. Um, and we're going to continue with a great song entitled Spring is Here. Spring, when the world was riding through. 
writing stuff. This is my first Facebook live session ever, ever in the world. So this is great. Thank you, Israeli artist group, uh, project, sorry, for um, giving us this opportunity. We're going to continue with a great song 
that has a great story behind it that I like to tell. Uh, this story takes place in uh, the 1920s. Um, it was written by a duo, Jimmy McHugh and Dorothy Fields. Um, and they were strolling down Fifth Avenue. They had no masks on. They were holding hands. Everything was super cool. Our audience here likes my joke. Um, and basically what happened was they uh, came across this couple staring at a piece of really sparkly jewelry in a Tiffany store. The store was open. Yes, it was. <laughs> and as they came closer, they heard the conversation between the two. And the guy told the girl, gee, baby, I'd love to buy you a sparkler like that one. But right now, I can't give you anything but love. Jimmy and Dorothy were like, damn, that's going to be a great, great, great hit. Mm -hmm. And here we are, a uh, hundred years later, we're singing it. This is, I can't give you anything but love. B flat, one, two, one, and three. three. has a great um, new meaning 
in these current times. Social call. This is a great uh, tune written by Gigi Grice entitled Social Call. Got me feeling like a horse 
that never left the post. I lie in my room, staring up at the ceiling. Spring can really hang you up the most. Morning's kiss wakes trees and flowers, and to them I'd like to drink a toast. I walk in the park just to kill lonely hours. Spring can really hang you up the most All afternoon those birds twitter twit I know the tune, this is love, this is it I heard it before That spring is a bull. Love seems sure around the new year. Now it's April. Love is just a ghost. Spring arrived on time. Only what became of you, dear? Spring can really hang you up the Sweet promise, but something went wrong. Doctors once prescribed a tonic, so fair and molasses was the dose. Didn't help a bit. My condition must be chronic. Spring can really hang you up the most All alone The party's over Old man winter was a gracious host But when you keep praying in spring. We don't know because we're not outside, but we're 
assuming there's there are bees. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it's like there's always a silence, an awkward silence, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> so you don't know when you're when you're making funny jokes or not. Okay. <laughs> One, two, you got it. One, two, three, four. song of our set because it's um, amazing how a lot of people don't have money uh, these you know in these days um, financially struggling so this song uh, is meant to cheer all you guys up in that aspect you know what it is yeah right? <laughs> okay mm -hmm. 
two, and one, two, three, four. The moon belongs to everyone. The best things in life are free. What, oh, Gary? Yeah. Let's, oh, let's no, restart let's that. restart it because we're not in the... on the piano. Yay! Thank you. We should have a machine. Um, I'm Nama Geber. Um, so, thank you guys for tuning in tonight. Uh, we have a few things to tell you and then we'll be happy to talk to you and hear what you guys have to say. Or I need to read all the comments, which I haven't yet. Um, the first thing is, is that we want to thank um, the Israeli Artists Project for having us here today. Um, it's really fun. And this is, we both talked about it and it's like our first time actually performing in over a month. So thank you. Uh, second thing is that if you have enjoyed what you've, um, been listening to, uh, and you have extra money, which maybe some people still have, I don't know. Um, oh, it's look, it's upside down. It's the other way. I didn't think about that when I made a sign. Um, but you could see, uh, my Venmo or PayPal. Um, <laughs> what if you hold it upside down? Though? In the link. I can't. It's in Hebrew. No, no. Turn it up. How? Um, oh, like that. Oh, uh, see? Mm -hmm. That was a genius. Um, <laughs> great. I was good for something. <laughs> 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 um, and then here is um, uh, how you can hear more. I don't know how to do this. But... Um, you can see uh, my website, namagaber.com. You can find me on all social media. Um, I will also connect you to Nadav if you are interested in listening more. He's single. He's single. Oh, not, he's not. I'm not single. He's not single. I'm not single. Um, and <laughs> here's um, my email. Great. And um, there's a CD out. Uh, it just came out um, April 10th. 
So uh, if you are interested, uh, you can check it out via um, live stream or uh, you can buy the actual CD if you talk to me about it. Um, great. So let's read some of the comments and see if anybody asks a question or if you guys... Oh, and it's in the description. Thank you. Um, let's see if you guys... If you guys want to ask anything right now is a great time because we'll be happy to answer. People are just saying beautiful things and everybody's watching. All of our friends. Yay. Hi, guys. Um... So Nadav, do you want to tell us about, about should we tell them how we met? Because that's actually a good story. Um, no. We met studying together in Israel. You go ahead. Yeah, we, yeah. we were actually in the same ensemble, <clears throat> which is like seven years ago now, I think. Oh my God, <clears throat> seven years ago. Yeah, um, we both kind of knew what we were doing, but we really did it. And we had a great teacher. Um, Danny Rosenfeld. Danny Rosenfeld, yeah. Who taught us a lot. Um, so much that we both ended up in New York City. Uh, a few years later, yeah. and we've been here since, um, making music apart and together. Yeah. Is there another question? No. Anybody else have questions? <laughs> That's what they're... Oh, a question. I'm going to buy the CD when I find out how. I will tell you, Elizabeth. <laughs> will you be touring soon? Well... <laughs> Touring, that's a, that's a um, hard, um, that's, that's a rough that's subject. Fun. Why? Because the reason why I chose to play April in Paris as the first song was because I was supposed to be in Paris at the end of March. Um, there was a whole CD release tour planned, um, which sadly was canceled, uh, not canceled, postponed, to when um, we all get healthy and ready to work and travel again. Um, and when that will happen, I will probably be all over the place. <laughs> or so I hope. If anybody has ideas of great venues, then they, they please um, also, you can let me know via DM. Um, great. <laughs> when is the next one coming out? <laughs> My next record, uh, that's a great question. That is in the works, actually. Um, stay tuned. Yeah, I think that's, that's great. Should we wait for another three minutes for another three comments? Or, another or we could just, if there's no more questions, we, we should, should play, play one, one more song. We're going to play one more song. That's what we should do. Great. That's... So thank you guys again for being with us. We really hope you are safe and healthy and <clears throat> that you remain to be safe and healthy and that you have some kind of income somehow or help and that you're staying sane. Um, and we hope that we were able to bring you some comfort. Uh, through this really crazy time. Um, yeah, and we're gonna end. Oh, we didn't do the Mother Hubbard. Okay. Oh, we should end with a song about a dog because that's like, the best way to end anything. <laughs> you know, I mean, I'm sorry, I haven't been on stage for a really long time. I've had her. So <laughs> great. All right, D flat. Yeah. What? Two, a one, a two, three, a four. <laughs>
Bob's chicken fish bones. Anything you see, there must be somewhere in this whole wide world. Oh, there gotta be a bone for me. Dog, dog, said a little dog, this ain't no way to do. Oh, if you were hungry, you wanted a bone. Thank you guys so much. I just have to read you this last thing. Couldn't you both make great music from Israel too? Asking for a mom who has a son in New York. Oh. Aww. We could, but that would mean that we'd have to take a flight and be in quarantine for 14 days. And so we decided to stay here. But we miss you guys in Israel very much. <laughs> Right. All right, guys, thank you so much. Please stay healthy and be well, and thank you so much. Thanks, everybody. Bye, guys.